I really need to come up with more creative intros. Vidcon, Vidcon, going to Vidcon, going to Vidcon. Vidcon, Vidcon, going to Vidcon, going to Vidcon. Hey guys, it's Zara, and today I am going to tell you the story of me going to Vidcon last year. Yay! So, um... I really wanted to go to VidCon as soon as I heard about it when the Vlogbrothers announced it. So, I pretty much just bought a ticket and went. There wasn't really any, like, um, drama around that or anything. <coughs> um, so, last year, around, like, last summer, I was a huge, 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 huge fangirl. Which, I, I mean, I still am. But for Shane Dawson and Charlie is so cool like. They were like my gods, like those two men were what my life revolved around. Um, so obviously since they were both going to be at VidCon I was extremely excited and it was all I really cared about was seeing them. Um, I made, Shane Dawson's birthday was the weekend after VidCon, so I had made him this quilt type thing. Um, it was like a yard of fabric each way and so I guess like one square yard. And it was full of, like, index cards that said, I laughed, I smiled, I cried, I what up. And it was full of those index cards. And in the middle, there was a big square that says, in three months, this is how many, this is how much you affect me. Thank you. Do you uh, and then it was, like, love Zara or something like that. And what I had done is I bought my tickets three months before VidCon was. And every time I would watch one of his videos, and he would make me laugh or smile or cry or have a new inside joke or whatever, I would make one of those cards. And I had them in a pile, and then I attached them all, and needless to say, it was really cool. So after waiting in line for about four hours to meet Shane, he was, he was awesome. And I literally was just like, oh my god, oh my god, okay, I, I, I cannot, oh, I could not, like, I could not breathe. It was just amazing like the fact that he was actually there in person and like I was talking to him which is like ah so um I waited in line got to meet him I got him to sign my shirt and um which I'll show you in a minute and I gave him the thing and you know told him in three months like this is how much how wow. much how happy you've made me and I love you and da 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 and Shane started crying and he was like, oh my gosh, this means so much to me. It like, knowing that I affect people and that I change people's lives and that, you know, in a sh three months I've done this but much. The camera over here, Zara. And, you know, like, affected you so much, it, it made him cry. And so I started crying because, like, my idol and my god and, like, my person that I love was there in front of me crying, like, tears of happiness and joy. And I was like, oh my god! So I started crying, and then he was like, <laughs> and then we like posed for a picture, and we were both crying, and like he slammed his head into mine, and he's like, now you can add to that, I got, <laughs> got my head slammed into, and it was really funny, so I gave it to him, and I, I don't know if he still has it, or, I mean, it's probably not anywhere, because he has a lot of fans, and a lot of fan mail, and whatever, so, but you know, I don't really care if he likes it, if he has it now, and if he, you know, whatever, because he had it. And he cried, and he showed his thanks for that. Like, that was enough for me, knowing that I could make him cry and make him so happy. And then, later on at VidCon, I had lost my camera. And the last place I remembered having it was in that room where Shane Dawson was. So I tried to go back and... You lost your camera? Shh. Why'd you lose your camera? Shh. Stop. Talking, please. So I lost my camera, and I went back, and I was, I was crying, and I was like, oh my god, my camera... All of my footage was on it from VidCon, everything was on it, and I was freaking out. And um, the room where Shane Dawson was in was closed, and him and Jared and Brittany Louise Taylor were all just like sitting in there talking and chilling. And Olga Kay came up and was like, oh honey, honey, what's wrong? And at that point, I, I was also in love with Olga Kay. I mean, she wasn't as much, it wasn't as much as Charlie or Shane, but I loved Olga Kay. And I was like, I, I lost my camera, and da 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 and she went in opened the door for me and was like, go ahead and look. And I'm like, oh my god, oh, okay, I love you. Moosh, ah, I love you. So 
I went in and I looked for my camera and I'm like looking under all the chairs and Shane and Jared and Brittany like noticed that someone else was in the room. It was a really big room. So they look back and Shane is like, and I walked up to Shane and I'm like, hey, do you remember me? And he's like, yeah, honey, Zara, what's wrong? And I was like, oh my God, he remembered my name. But I was so really upset about the camera. So, you know, whatever. I told him and I was like, I lost my camera and he helped me look for it. And it was just so awesome that he was so cool and so like down to earth and so like, aww. <laughs> On the other hand, I'm Charlie, I, this is like a news flash that so many people will probably shake you all up. But at VidCon last year, Charlie was kind of a jerk. I know I hate to say it too, but Charlie was a jerk last year. He was ignoring his fans. He was running away when people were chasing him. He's like, no, 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 I have to go. And it was more like he was there to, to see and meet the big YouTubers rather than meet his fans, which was kind of upsetting, but whatever. You know, I had the whole thing with Shane, so that made up for it. Last year, I know, I, this, this video was so, like, out of order. I, because of Shane, because of Charlie's Purple Man video, I bought purple paint, like body paint, and attempted to paint myself completely purple. My face, my my chest, my arms, my legs, everything was going to be completely purple. And it didn't really work out so well, but hey, it was worth a try, and I bet that's something you never knew about me and my brother's talking, and I'm sorry, I'm babysitting, and this is a one-take video, which is now like seven minutes long. But, yes, um, that's my VidCon story. I'm looking forward to hearing about your guys' story last year. Um, yeah, about the giveaways, the winner is... Ooh, I don't remember. Where's my paper? Where's my paper? Oh my gosh, I lost my paper. Oh, rainbows, rainbows falling, failing. I don't remember if it's falling or failing. Rihanna, yay, you're the winner. Thanks to random.org, you are the winner. Yay. So... I'm pretty sure I already have your address for the Nerdfighter Circle Journal. Um, so yeah, I will send the gnome book to you. This week I'm giving away a copy of John Green's Looking for Alaska. So comment, make sure you're subscribed, and yeah, you could be a winner. Yay! Okay, see you guys next week. Bye!